Hello there everybody, I would like to welcome you back to Harvest Moon Animal Parade and in this video we are going to go and visit Selena because if we remember from a few videos ago she actually ran away from home and she found a job at the brass bar so let's go in and talk to her. So she got a job dancing I guess which is what she wanted as we can see here. Hey Nick. This is Selena, our new dancer. I already found a place to dance! Um, I know it's a lot to ask, but could you deliver this letter to my parents? Please, Nick, ease her parents' worries by letting them know that she's fine. So Selena will give you a letter, basically, to bring back to her parents because she decides that she's going to stay here forever because she got a job and everything and you know why wouldn't she stay so you have to wait till the brass bar opens to come and get Selena's letter and then after that you have it in your inventory and you can bring it back to Sue and Samson whenever you feel like it now I honestly think it's probably too late to go on the boat but I'm gonna try it anyways, because I have my boat ticket. Yeah, it's too late. Gosh. Mm. I'm thinking that the, f the fishery closes at 5 o'clock. So it would probably make sense that you can't go to Toucan Island past 5 o'clock. Okay, so. Alright, so now that you have Selena's letter, you can you have to buy a boat ticket, first of all, to get back to Toucan Island. And then you have to bring the letter with you when you go, so that you can give the letter to Selena's parents. And this is a side quest that is that is required in the game as well. So, it's not optional. But you can do it at, at any time, you know, so, whenever you feel like it. I'm actually going to skip ahead to the next day, as you can see my stamina bars and red I've pretty much worked myself to death for the day fed my animals they're all inside did my farming and all that so I guess I'll just go to sleep and then get the side quest done and over with and then do the rest of the stuff I need to do for the day later on tomorrow all right so I'm gonna go to bed and I'll be seeing you guys in harmonica town in the morning Alright, so we're back in Harmonica Town now. It's a brand new day. I'm all rested up and it, it's good weather outside. It's sunny, so the boat will take us if it's, you know, a thunderstorm outside or something like that. The boat won't take us, so keep in mind that you have to have Selena's letter to finish this side quest, obviously. You have to have your boat ticket and then you have to have it be good weather. So I'm going to give my boat ticket to Pascal here. And we're gonna go to Toucan Island once more. Go pay a visit to Sue and Samson. Sucks to have a teenage runaway. I probably have to wait until the store opens. Probably doesn't open until like 8 o'clock. Or something, I would guess. 8 o'clock, yeah. Alright, well, let's just go pick up some stuff. Because a lot of the villagers like stuff from the island. Like, some of them like bananas or pineapples, if you can find them around here. They make good gifts. I mean, they're f I guess they're they're not technically free because you have to pay money to come to Toucan Island. But, I mean, there's something different you can give to villagers. You can make stuff with them if you feel like it. You can make juices and things like that. And it's totally random. Like, sometimes they'll give you... A bunch of stuff and it doesn't look like there's much here today so just that banana which is kind of a bummer hello big panda and little panda I wonder what they like because usually each animal that you find has something they like you know cats for example like fish you can give them a fish rabbits like carrots I'm not too sure what the panda likes maybe the maybe the panda likes fish I don't know I mean bears like fish I haven't really tried Quite honestly, but it would be kind of difficult to get the panda to come live with you, I think. 
which is probably why they put it on Toucan Island. They would think, oh yeah, everyone wants a panda, and then they just, were just total jerks about it. Oh, I didn't even see these. Coconuts! And if you are trying to su uh, suppress, <laughs> impress, sorry, impress Selena, she pretty much liked all of this stuff. She loves coconuts, pineapples, bananas. So what you can do is, if you're a fan of Toucan Island, you can just come here and gather all that stuff, save them in, you know, your toolbox or something, and give them to her. But she likes other things like seashells and stuff like that. She's really not hard to impress, but... Whatever floats your boat. So now that it's open and we have her letter, we should probably go in and talk to her parents. What? A letter from her runaway daughter? Yeah. I guess she was she was still kind of worried about her parents. She was trying to be nice about it. Dear Mom and Dad, I'm sorry for running away, but don't worry. I got a job dancing at the town bar. The owner is very nice. I'll come home on my days off. See you soon. Love, Selena. It sounds like she's doing well. I'm still worried about her. She had to leave the nest someday. We'll just have to hope that we raised her well. It sounds like Selena's doing okay. That's a real relief to hear. Thank you. You're welcome. Here's a gift for delivering that letter. It's the lovely flower of Toucan Island, the hibiscus. It's one of the ingredients that the wizard needs, so this is why it's required. Uh, at the start of the game, this is the only way that you, that you can get the hibiscus seed, because Samson... Samson will not sell hibiscus seeds until you get the whole conflict with Sue, Selena, and Samson figured out. I think he said in a few videos ago that he wants to he wanted to sell the seeds, but he couldn't like quote unquote sell such a beautiful happy flower with all the sadness going on or something like that. So now once you have the hibiscus, he'll he'll actually sell them in his store now. You can buy them for 40g. Uh, you can give them to villagers, some villagers like flowers. They don't exactly sell for a whole lot, so, I mean, it's not really worth it. Sure, they're a pretty flower, but that, that's pretty much all they are. They don't have a lot of purpose, so it's definitely up to you. And if you accidentally, I don't know, use your hibiscus flower before you give it to the wizard or something like that, or you accidentally use it as a present, you can just come back here and buy it. You don't have to buy the actual seeds, so... That's good, I guess. As you can see, he also has more stuff on his menu that he didn't have before we came in here. It was pretty bare, but now that we've done the side quest, uh, he's he's got some more stuff for us. So, and as, he's got some more recipes as well. So you can buy any of these recipes and make them at home or whatever. So, Toucan Island gets a little bit updated as well when you solve that side quest. So that's it. That's. The final ingredient that the wizard needs because I have the good cornmeal. I'll be showing you guys how to make that in the next video though. And in the next video we're probably going to ring the green bell. Although it's, you know, it's really soon in the game to have pretty much all of the bells done. But, um, yeah, we're probably going to ring the bell and see what how that goes. As far as I know, bringing the letter to Selena's parents doesn't really increase her heart her hearts with her it's just kind of one of those things that the game expects you to do anyways so once you have this side quest taken care of you can ring the green bell you cannot ring the green bell without doing the quest selena will now permanently live on the castanet i always forget the name it's castanet like country or province or whatever the hell it is that you live so she lives in harmonica town and even though it says she'll come over on her days off she usually just stays around harmonica town on her days off so don't worry about like missing her or anything like that she pretty much stays around at all times and you can come to toucan island you know as you as you want and there's not a whole lot of problems on here after this ordeal is all sorted out so i want to thank you guys so much for joining me for another video of harvest moon animal parade i hope that you enjoyed it was very nice to have you hope you have a great day and i hope that you'll be joining me in the next video